What is going on? Darth Six here today, and we are going to take a look at the seven star Thrawn unlock that we completed. Uh, we can see there's Ezra. Uh, he is the only one that is above the recommended power level. Uh, everybody else is just below it. Uh, we do have everybody at uh, gear nine or gear eight. Uh, Hera is at gear nine. I thought I could put an extra gear tier on her just because eventually at some point on this account, we will probably go for profundity. So not a big deal there. But yes, this uh, event is very well. Um, it, there is some RNG in it. Uh, most of the first, the three, there's four phases total. The first three phases are really where it's going to be uh, pretty easy. And then the fourth phase is, is really um, much more difficult uh, and has a lot more RNG to it. Uh, so we are going to uh, taunt with Chopper. Basically, what you want to be doing is taunting between um, Chopper and Kanan, and then everybody else just does damage. Uh, Hera calling assists and then putting the uh, basically the revive on somebody occasionally. Uh, we really, uh, right now, uh, we did... Uh, you just want to get a few of these guys down pretty quick um, and then, you know, start just working away on them. Uh, I do use the abilities on this uh, because I can uh, spread out the damage a little bit between those guys, Kanan and Chopper, and then uh, get some of these out quickly. Uh, once we get to the later phases, you will see that uh, I try to uh, reduce cooldowns and make sure that we're, you know, ready going into phase four on those cooldowns uh, that we've got everything off of cooldown and can go in there guns blazing and take out everybody really fast. Um, if you are going to go, uh, this is obviously a later account. Uh, I'm at uh, just under 3 million when I did this or at 3 million. Um, so uh, going for C, on this account is why I started to uh, farm Phoenix. I did not farm them early game. So obviously, if you farm them early game, um, you know, you're not going to be able to get them to 85 probably because it'll be one of your first teams that you tried to do. But even getting Thrawn to five stars was pretty simple. Uh, and I think you guys can do it uh, with lower gear accounts and lower levels. So you see, we took out quite a few there on uh, just... Uh, the counters so everybody does have a chance to counter and so that can sometimes if they do an AOE that can really cause them issues and that is going to you know get rid of get your team uh, uh, advancing more quickly if they do that so that's why I try to maintain the cooldowns and everything and here do that and so we can do the flourish here and get rid of his shield uh, but not really necessary. We just do basic there. And then here, another basic, basic. And he does AoE, so that's going to take him out. So that's one thing you want to keep track of. Like, they can do those AoEs, and, and that is fine. Here, um, I would recommend going for the Death Troopers first. They're not as hard on this level. They're going to throw an AoE first most of the time, and that's gonna they're going to get KO'd just by the counters. You can see both of them get KO'd. So it's kind of up to you what you want to do there. They're a lot easier on this level, on this phase. Um, and so we are just going to do basics here. We've already got three of the six uh, troopers down, so we can just do basics and have our cooldowns ready into the next one. And you can see just basic again. Ezra is nice. He does have a chance to uh, double hit with his lightsaber. Um, so that is uh, one thing you want to use for sure. And then here we go versus Thrawn here. Uh, this, uh, his fracture is going to be the biggest thing uh, determining you know, whether this is going to be a good run or not. Uh, if that fracture goes on somebody that we need to deal damage or call to assist, that is going to be a problem. You see a nice AoE there. And they do have quite a bit of shields. So we are going to, you know, get the taunt up and we do get the taunt before he throws the fracture. So it goes on chopper. So that is not a huge deal. Um, and then there we did get some hits on the uh, death trooper and, and we went there and that probably wasn't the right call. 
Um, so we realized, oh yeah, we weren't on the right person. Unfortunately, we don't get the double lightsaber there from Ezra, so double hit on Ezra does not happen. Um, but we've got the stagger, and this Death Trooper is down now with that, just that counter uh, from Kanan. So we are in pretty good position here. Uh, Death Trooper keeps... Yeah, we just want to keep hitting that Death Trooper. We're going to do the flourish there to get rid of that... Uh, I think it was potency up is what it was. I'm not exactly sure what it was. Now that I think about it, accuracy, something, I don't know. What that symbol was, I'd have to go back and look. Uh, and it is almost down. We're going to go ahead and do that. And boom. So both Death Troopers are down. Uh, now here, you could start targeting... Um, Thrawn, but I would recommend at least taking one of these Stormtrooper commanders out first. The reason is they can provide a lot of healing uh, when Thrawn gets kind of low, and if you take at least one out, I think it's going to make it easier uh, for you to get through Thrawn. And you can see now um, Zeb is pretty low and is uh, got fractured, so that's not great. What we're going to try to do is... Um, Get rid of, you know, make sure he stays alive. Uh, we just did a sacrifice. Uh, you know, the revival be on right now is on open. Now it's off of Canaan. So we're looking. Oh, see the those healings there is always a problem. So we do get the taunt, and then here now that the fracture is gone, we can call Zeb and he'll get some protection. Um, so that's going to help us keep him alive. And now that we took out one of the commanders, I'm going to go ahead and go for Thrawn now. And go ahead and keep hitting him. We got an expose uh, flourish here. I, I hit the flourish there, and the reason I do that is because he does get extra turn meter off of it if he's not dispelling any, debu any buffs on them. So it is useful for that as well. Um, and we can call... Ezra here to assist. And then just Ezra can do a basic here. There's not a whole lot else we can do. Uh, we're doing okay, but really uh, where that fracture goes, so there we go. So we had a taunt up and he did the fracture. That was fine. And so it went to Kanan and that is okay. We'll put the, uh, what did, I, I forget what her special is called, but whatever, it, it provides a revive if he does happen to get taken out here. And you can see just moving those taunts back and forth between them uh, really does help um, to allow for for this. And there we go. We take out that Stormtrooper finally. And you can see Thrawn is getting lower and lower. And we get Daze. and get Billy Block. And, the, and that Stormtrooper commander just went, so we might have a good chance of taking him out here. Uh, nope, and he gets a heal before we can get another. And that's the thing. If you have two of those guys, two of those Stormtrooper commanders, they just keep back and forth like every time they get below a certain health. They're, they're constantly doing it. So I do recommend getting rid of at least one. Uh, if you get rid of both of them, I think that's fine too. You can leave the Stormtrooper in the back um, until you take him out. Just naturally, you kind of take him out um, because he does have that taunt. Uh, so that is... And then at this point, it gets pretty easy. We don't have to worry about Thrawn taking out one of our members now. I think you can do it at lower gear, obviously, uh, than what I'm running here. But there we go. And that is going to be the end of that. And 7-star Thrawn is ours. So really a solid event. Uh, definitely gear 9 is the max I would take anybody to. And I didn't have all abilities applied. And we had some decent mods there. So you can see we are going on that sea journey. And here's Grand Normal Thon. Thanks for watching this guide. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. As always, thanks for watching.